This is how you make masala chai. And no, it's not gonna taste like Starbucks or Tim Hortons chai. This actually has flavor. Here's how to do it. Grab about the same cup of water that you use to drink out of. And to that, you can add some spices such as fennel seeds, cinnamon, cardamom pods, cloves, some ginger if you wish, and then some high quality black tea and just let that boil. Then after a few minutes, you can add in your milk and the water to milk ratio should be almost the same and let this boil as well for at least five minutes. And at this point, you can add your sugar or you can add sugar into the cup. After that, just pour it and enjoy. And this chai is so good that we got into TikTok's first ever cookbook. Yeah, boy. So they got our masala chai recipe and they also got some kofi, specifically cookies and cream kofi. And honestly, there's a whole bunch of other great creators here. Too much to name, but I gotta name a few. And starting off with our boy, Golden Balance. You're gonna get lost in the sauce with these Parmesan garlic chicken wings. Yeah, boy. After that, we got the OG uncle of TikTok, USA Jalanda. He's making some bomb fish pakoras. And to name a few more, we have the Moody Foodie, Korean Vegan, Rooted in Spice, Zeno, Diana, Shreya, H. Wu, Cooking Bomb, Ivan, and we got Linja up in here. So I'm happy that we got to share how to make masala chai because trust me, after you make this and you taste it, you're not gonna wanna visit Starbucks or Tim Hortons again because they don't make chai. They sell water that tastes like expired cinnamon. 